This is Eddie Hearn, Matchroom Boxing. You're watching Sporting Icons. You don't need to be anywhere else. So, Anthony Joshua has called on Tyson Fury. Now, he's pretty much saying the same things that I've said in previous videos when ever since Tyson Fury defeated Deontay Wilder, of course, there's a, a huge, huge opportunity for two Brits to come together for undisputed. Me, personally, I want to see Dillian White fight Tyson Fury first and then the winner go fight Anthony Joshua. They're two massive fights, right? But anyway, if Anthony Joshua and Tyson Fury um, can get it on, that's a mega fight, is it not? Now, I've said on plenty of occasions now that Tyson Fury and Anthony Joshua, they both have a legitimate claim to be or be called number one. At the same time, neither of them can call themselves number one. We've been through all this scenario. I've done videos on it, um, but not too long ago. So let's go... Go into my um, playlist and you can see them all there, okay? Now, I said time and time again, if Joshua wants to be called number one, he needs to go see Tyson Fury. If Tyson Fury wants to be called number one, he needs to go see Anthony Joshua. I said this in plenty of videos, okay? Which is the, the obvious thing, isn't it? I mean, for me, there's nothing more that I want to hear about, well, who's number one? Tyson Fury's number one. Anthony Joshua's number one. Well, let's get in the ring and, fight and find out. I'm not interested in the whole debate about it. Get in the ring and let's find out. Anyway, Anthony Joshua has said similar. And this is what Anthony Joshua has said to Tyson Fury. Come fight me. If you really want to say you're number one, come fight me. Let's get it on. One dominant figure in their division will become undisputed. To prove yourself as number one, I have to go see Tyson Fury. Tyson Fury has to go see Anthony Joshua. That's Anthony Joshua's statement. And I couldn't say it any better. Well, I, I could because I've said it before. So that's the reality of it. Joshua understands fully. I, I, I can call myself number one. I've got um, multiple belts. I'm a unified champion. Fury, okay, you once held these belts, but you never defended them. Is what it is. You've got one belt. I've got three. For the undisputed. So he can call himself number one. Tyson Fury can say, yeah, but I won all those belts. I never lost them in the ring. Right, right, right. Screw all that. Get in the ring and have a fight. Let's sort it out one way or another. Whoever comes out on top, comes out on top. I've got no horse in this race. None whatsoever. Okay. I like both of these guys equally. I'm proud of both of them. And I want to see them both fight. I want to see them get it on. I don't care if it's for undisputed or not undisputed. Ideally, of course. If it's going to be next, of course. But there's this is... A very good opportunity if the borders are closed if fury can't fulfill his contractual obligations against wilder if joshua can't fulfill his contractual obligations against pulev and there's an opportunity where uk boxing can still go ahead what's wrong with these two getting it on what's wrong with that or tyson fury fight dillian white who wouldn't want to go see that fight Again, that's another massive stadium fight, is it not? Anyway, that's Anthony Joshua's statement, and I totally agree with it. If Anthony Joshua wants to call himself number one, you've got to go see Tyson Fury. If Tyson Fury wants to call himself number one, you've got to go see Anthony Joshua. There's no point talking about it. There's no point debating about it. Nobody's ever going to be right on this one, and nobody's ever going to be wrong on this one. The only way to settle it, get in the ring. And let's get one name, one face, one champion, and it ain't going to be Deontay Wilder. It's going to be a Brit. That's my thoughts. You drop me yours. Click thumbs up, subscribe. Catch you all in the next video.